there's been this very long, you know, standing feud between vampires and lichens and uh, um, and in this movie, you know, Celine's very much disenfranchised from both. She's not really part of the team of vampires anymore. She's sort of, she starts out the movie basically on the run from everybody, you know, having, uh, the, you know, in Underworld 4, she'd sort of struck out on her own with her daughter and, and is basically looking for Michael. Um, so now she finds herself, you know, really on the run from everyone. I think she's had enough. She's, you know, she's been around for thousands of years. She's lost everything that's important to her and she's got really nothing to fight for. I think she's really just over it. I think the one thing that's kind of keeps her going is um, the possibility of finding Michael, um, which who has proved fairly elusive now for, for a while. Um, but she's really weary, she's over it. And she has got this core venous blood that makes her very powerful, but at the same time, you know, she's not, she's not invincible. You know, she's, she's, and she's got quite, you know, it's bristling with enemies. I don't know. I'm always, I'm always so, so pleased that people, people want to see this. I, I, I find Celine such a tragic character. Really, she's, she's so often, you know, she's, she just wants to kind of love someone and have them not betray her, you know. And I think, I think that that it's sometimes quite difficult with a female uh, heroine in a movie like this, you know, because it's not, you can't just flip it. Um, you do want your female lead to have an emotional life uh, in a slightly different way, I think, than you do a man. Um, and I think that's partly, that's partly why. I think that, I think women and men like to see, you know, women kicking ass, taking names. But I also think there's a, you know, there's a sort of historical kind of legacy element to it that I think people find appealing. I really do like the fact that there's all these new different characters and there's such a transformation going on for Celine in this movie and, and the stakes are very, very high. 